Obviously, it's uh, good to get a win there tonight. Uh, sloppy game on our part, but uh, we'll take it. And, you know, hopefully we uh, improve tremendously between game one and game two. Uh, did some things tonight that uh, we didn't see coming or unexpected, and uh, we got to play better on uh, both sides of the football in the crucial times of the game. So, but uh, we've got some time. We've got an extra day of preparation for the next game, so we'll uh, get that addressed right away. And, Move forward. Can we talk about the, the goal line stand that you had and it felt like kind of changed the game? Huge play. Um, you know, we're, we're, they had the ball on the one yard line, I think it was, and I didn't know if they were going to go for it or not. And Ollie came up and made a big uh, big play there. They were trying to pick us, and Ollie made a play and was probably the turning point of the game. How about it, uh, Darcy's run for the 80 yarders? Yeah, I was kind of surprised he got out and. Uh, you know, I was hoping he'd get all the way in the end zone, but that was a nice run by him. Uh, hit it another gear there and uh, took care of the football. Bellamy's a guy that uh, has a chance to be a good football player. And, you know, you guys haven't had a chance to see a lot of him. He's been dinged up here and there, and he's finally getting his opportunity. Defense as a whole really played well tonight. I thought the team, you know, kind of needed them to step up at times, and, you know, they did that. They did, you know. I mean, I think defensively, you guys saw us a bunch of times on third down coming free. You know, we thought we were going to have a big loss yardage play and loss contain away from the blitz, but uh, that's all correctable, and, uh, you know, we felt like we could keep pressure on them because uh, they were having a hard time picking us up and blocking. But uh, if you don't keep contained, they can keep it alive by scrambling around. But, uh, yeah, overall, uh, you know, I thought we did some good things there on defense. Uh, could have been a lot better on third down than we were. Uh, kind of gave them one on a penalty, uh, you know, early on, uh, which was a gimme. And then we last contained a couple of times, which was really frustrating for us coaches because it should have been a 15, 20-yard loss play. I know it's not all on Kurt, but, you know, passing game was really, just didn't really click at all in the second Passing game. game was really poor, uh, you know. I didn't think, first of all, I didn't think we did a very good job of protecting the quarterback, you know. Uh, and then I think we had some opportunities to hit some guys, and, you know, we just didn't hit them. And the next thing you know, we're punting the football uh, on some crucial downs that should have been uh, elementary completions for us. Did you feel like Kurt was losing some confidence there in the second half? I think we only threw it like three times. Well, I mean, we were running the ball, you know. And, uh, you know, when you can run the football, uh, you got to go back to what you can do, and uh, you know we've got some good backs back there, so we need to run the football and, and play action pass and continue to work. You know, Christian Bryan was out, and obviously that was a, a loss there. I don't expect him to be out very long, but you know uh, he's a he's a he's a he's a playmaker, especially on third down for us. You talk about the importance of special teams and field position changes. Well, I think Nick List uh, showed tonight. He had two punts that were just huge. And uh, Nick List is a weapon. He did a great job punting the football. Uh, we did some different things in the punt game as far as, uh, you know, the way we operate. Um, and I think that uh, that was a, a benefit to us. You know, uh, you know, first kick off, we kicked the ball down there. They tried to bring it out. and We swarmed the field pretty good there. So we made some progress there. Obviously disappointed and uh, botched a uh, fair catch right there. And, uh, you know, those things can't happen because you give them the ball right down there in the red zone. And uh, that's just a, a crucial mistake. Right. One more question. Yes, ma'am. Which, which would be the easiest player for you to work with? Um, I would say we're going to start working with that offensive line. Uh, we'll work with them as a group, all five of them. Uh, make sure we get the right five in there. and. Uh, Make sure we're doing a better job of uh, protecting our quarterback and keeping him standing upright.